Hello everybody, my name is Riley Saunders and I've been saying for years that Winnipeg, Manitoba is the music capital of Canada. This little known freezing cold city is home to some of the most amazing artists and they have nothing better to do than sit around, play music and write songs. The Spare Room is a show I created to shine a light on some of these artists. It's about more than just the music. It's about gaining a glimpse into the minds and personalities of the human beings behind the songs. From my spare room to the comfort of your home, I present to you Taylor Izzy Morgan. Day after day after day after day after day. I was always into music. My parents used to tell me that the only way that they'd get me to sleep uh, when they had house parties is if they put me by the speaker <laughs> and they'd play, you know, all, the, all, all their music, everything like that. But uh, first real good memory of mine is uh, my dad got me my first guitar when I was seven years old and uh, just fell in love with it, started playing it, you know, hours and hours and hours every day until my fingers would bleed. And now luckily I got the calluses to save myself from that. But uh, yeah, I'd say seven years old, getting my first guitar. It was just a giant Tiger acoustic guitar, about this big, but, you know, look at me now. <laughs> I'm playing full-style guitars. <laughs> I'm Taylor Izzy Morgan from the band Dead Levy. This is our latest single, Shout. Hope you guys like it. I started playing guitar when I was seven. Uh, I played my first show when I was 12 for my grade six graduation. Um, and uh, and th through high school, played in the high school rock band and all that kind of stuff. Growing up in Carmen, there wasn't many people to, uh, to play music with, but the ones I did find, you know, I got, that I got along with, we started a band and, uh, you know, started playing football and trying to balance football and music. My pa I'm a very passionate person, so it's just the battle of passions. And then uh, when I was 18, I moved out to uh, I moved out to Weyburn, met some people, started playing acoustic shows out there, 
uh, ended up opening up for Dead Levy, playing acoustic shows, um, just touring around with them, starting the night off with some covers of Whitney Houston or George Michaels or you name it, you know, get all the, uh, get all the older folks dancing and excited. And, uh, and then eventually the bass player of the band, you know, he, uh, he had other things he wanted to do and I was there ready to take the, uh, take the reins on that uh, position. And, you know, fast forward two and a half years after that, the band promoted me to lead singer and here I am, you know, playing bass and, and singing for Dead Levy. Like this, this next one I wrote, uh, <laughs> this one, uh, it's called My Heart's My Only Friend. And it's a song I wrote after like coming home, after being on the road for like literally two months straight. Yeah, you're gonna have to say this again. Good, well then let, let's start this <laughs> off again. Let me grab my beer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this next song is a song I wrote called uh, My Heart Is My Only Friend. And it was written right after I did about two months of my first tour and uh, you know, came home. First thing, first things first, heard silence for the first time in, in months and uh, decided to pick up my guitar and, and write this. This one's called My Heart's My Only Friend. Today I woke up and I was laying in my bed when another voice came to my mind. And even if I tried, I couldn't repeat what it said, so I won't try and sing it, I'll try and rephrase it, the voices inside of my head, you've got a million reasons why you should never win, but remember the few, where I've come in, well I am faith, I am hope, I'm everything you want, I'm the air that keeps you breathing, when one breath is all you got, so be sit still how it makes every bone in my body dance and uh and yeah i said that's what i love about music so this one's called rock and roll and whiskey uh it's a song about uh constantly being on the road and never being able to really maintain a healthy relationship uh, <laughs> and uh yeah i wrote this song with a friend of mine uh during the first dead levy tour when i was just opening up for him staying in hotel rooms and, and playing for you know onion ring plotters this one's called Rock and Roll Whiskey. I hope you did.
my time when I'm living too fast for you. And life can take its toll when you're living out of hotel rooms. So don't waste your time with a poor little fool like me. Cause I'm just rock and roll. Chimes coming from, you know? Ooh, yeah! That was a lot of fun, man. Thanks Taylor. for having me. Say something to the camera. Hey, this is Taylor Izzy Licks, Dead Levy. Thank you for having me, Riley. Yeah, you're welcome. Fun, man. Great fucking times. Holy shit, that was a good one. <laughs> Perfect. Day after day after day after day after day.